artwork has been imagined by a young Chinese artist, Yang Zheng Zhang, and the name of the piece is Long Life to the Great Union. It's like a 3D perspective on Tiananmen if you look straight from the right point, and in the center of the piece you have the portrait of Mao Zedong, the great Mao. But if you really look after the facade, what do you see? It's just, it's just paper, it's just fake. So it really deals with this idea of illusion. It's just an illusion about this idea of union, of Chinese union, which could be perhaps an illusion too. So in fact, it deals with political issue, but like a whisper of political issue. The Chinese art is really about understatement when it deals with politics. We have an idea about Chinese art, like Ai Weiwei, which is the most mediatic Chinese artist, but I think it's a wrong idea because most of them live in China and they are quite allowed to speak about political issue if it's about understatement. the same story about Chinese art and understatement, the art of understatement. In fact, one can see this beautiful garden, it's a Zen garden, apparently just a Zen garden, who has been made by a collective of Chinese artists from Shanghai, founded in 2009, called Made In, Made In reference to Made in China, the famous Made in China. Medina has made this work which is called Movement Field because if you really look at what's going on in the garden this is the drawing of some demonstration, famous demonstration all over the world. So in the Zen garden you have this idea, this memory of what was done politically in the past. Medina speak about contestation in a Zen way, very elegant way. In this Biennale, you really have to concentrate and to stare at the work, to understand what's going on, because it's about narration, it's about telling stories. Mm -hmm.